page three. A one-to-one -one function is a function, I'm sorry, is a set of ordered pairs in which each element of the domain corresponds to only one element of the range. And each element of the range corresponds to only one element of the domain. Every single one-to-one -one function must pass the vertical line test as well as the horizontal line test. So I give you an example as a set at the beginning. So here is example number one. It is the set of five points, four comma three, two comma six, six comma negative one, three comma two, and finally one comma six. And the first question says, Determine whether or not example one is a one-to-one -one function and justify your answer. So first, look at the x values. If the x values do not repeat, then it's definitely a function. It is a function. Because x values Do not repeat. But the real question was, is it a one-to-one -one function? If you want to determine if it's one-to-one -one function, the x values can't repeat, nor can the y values. So I'm looking at the y values, and I notice the y values repeat. So I can claim that it's not a one-to-one -one function because even though the x values do not repeat, the y values do repeat. So it is not a one-to-one -one function. Because the y values repeat. So the x values are not allowed to repeat and the y values are not allowed to repeat in a one-to-one -one function. Okay, part B. So even though it's not a one-to-one -one function, it still has a domain. The domain is the list of x values in numerical order. So I have a one, two, three, four, and six. And that takes care of listing the x values. Part C says determine the range. The range is the list of y values in order from smallest to largest. So I see a negative one, a two, a three, and I do see a six. And even though it's repeated twice, you only list it once. Now, on the bottom, it says an onto function is a function whose range is all real numbers. So I give you these two pictures down below. Basically, the one on the left sorta of looks like this. And the one on the right pretty much looks like that. My question would be, Determine whether they are onto. Now, anything that looks like a wave, and this looks like a wave, the domain is always negative infinity to positive infinity. Anything that looks like a wave that goes across the paper. However, the range, Your picture continues to go down forever based off of the way this is drawn. So the range is all the way down here, all the way up to a max at whatever this y value is. So I don't know what it is. Let's pretend that this maximum value has a height of 10. That would mean that the range to this went from negative infinity all the way up to positive 10, hit it, 
and that was it. This cannot be an onto function. So it is not onto. The reason why it is not onto is because the range is not negative infinity to positive infinity. That's how you tell if something is onto. So when you look at the next diagram, anything that looks like a nice flowing wave, the domain is always negative infinity to positive infinity, always. But the range here, since this side always goes down and this side always goes up, the range covers from all the way down to all the way up, which means your range goes from negative infinity to positive infinity. And any time the range goes from negative infinity to positive infinity, that implies that the function is onto. All right, this is a symbol for implies. So it implies that it is onto. So anytime your range goes from negative infinity to positive infinity, your function is onto. Now I want to just explain something about the top of the paper. When it said, is the function one-to-one? -one? When you abbreviate the words one-to-one, -one, it looks like this. Those two vertical lines mean it has to pass the vertical line test. And by the way, this passes the vertical line test. Each of these vertical lines only hit the function once and only once. Same here. This passes the vertical line test, right? As you go across, it passes. So they are both functions. But the horizontal line in the middle means it also has to pass the horizontal line test. This function is not one-to-one, -one, because if you notice, there was a horizontal line that actually intersected more than once. So this picture is not only not onto, it's not even one-to-one. -one. And it's because it doesn't pass the horizontal line test. I have the same issue on the second picture. Over here, it looks like it's one-to-one. -one. But the moment you hit here, you'll notice it intersects the graph more than once. Therefore, it cannot be one-to-one. -one. So both of them pass the vertical line test, making them both functions. But both of them happen to fail the horizontal line test, so therefore I cannot call them one-to-one -one functions.